Hello everyone, I'm Dragon Whoop and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included. When we last left off, we were trying to get our, uh, our metal refinery up and running. And I also realized that, uh, trying to do the automation stuff, that the, the, uh, metal doors, the basic metal doors, uh, manual airlocks as it were, do not actually share the mechanical, uh, automation as a mechanical lock, a mechanized airlock would do. So what today I'm going to do is I'm going to try to do my best to go ahead and get this up and running, try to get all this liquid over here and, and try to get some more things around the base done. Hopefully we can get down to uh, get some, oh my goodness, get some of these, oh gosh, what are they called? Oh, station checkpoints. Yes, the exosuit checkpoints. Start getting some exosuits and things of that nature. Start getting a massive amount of uh, oxygen produced in the base because as you can see right now, it's not that great. Um, and probably set up some, some, uh, water distilling areas because I got a really, really good suggestion from Peter Caliphas. He basically said that use the purified version of the, like the dirty water goes into a purifier, the purified water comes out. Basically it's germy and you have to find a way to kill the germs. Well, he says, if you run that germy water through an electrolyzer, then the germs are killed. So I'm going to test that theory today. Uh, hopefully we can get up. I think a good place for uh, an oxygen place would probably be up here. Probably off to the side here. Um, Some place really close where I can keep the dirty, the, 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 the germy water away from my clean source. Because the germy water is here. But uh, hopefully like make a little, just a small, small tank. And, uh, and allow it to be put up here. So I think this is a good, actually a really good spot for a couple of um, oxygen uh, electrolyzers. So that way the, all of the CO2 and all of, or not the CO2, all of the uh, hydrogen floats upwards. I uh, might actually create a hood and pump that through back into some, uh, some hydrogen generators. But uh yeah, actually, I think that might be a good idea. So this might not be a good place for it. Where can I put this? Probably here. Be centralized with... I was I was thinking here to begin with because it's centralized within the base. But... Um, I would wind up having to, to like dig up through this. I, well, that's not a bad idea. I think I could still do that. I'll have to move the the loom here but i could extend this out that's not a bad idea yeah let's go ahead and do that let's actually do that changing my mind on the fly look at that all right so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna deconstruct that hopefully they'll get that done uh go ahead and start getting this set up here uh where would i want to come over with it uh just go straight up and then build Say a walkway. Nope, not there. Take this down. And then build myself a walkway across like that. That looks like a good way to do it. Might want to go up one more. There we go. And then what I could do is make like a little hood section here. Uh, and then fill all of this area with... Um, oh, and this will be the airlock for this area. So that's not too bad. Yeah, I think that'll work. I think that'll work. All right. So that's done. So let's get this over here. Deconstruct that. Actually, cancel that. Cancel, cancel, cancel. Build. Build these first. And then I'll. What I'll do. Is this is not even hooked up to power. So I can go ahead and deconstruct this safely. And this is the Exosuit Forge, which I need to push up to some power. Well, I have the wire, wire cable run. But I think this cable is already to its max. Yeah, it's to its max. So what I need to do is probably set up another another row up here. How hot is it up there? It's not it's not too hot. I could put some wheeze warts to Do I have any wheeze warts? That's a key that's oops. That's the question. Let's see, do we have any weeds warts? No, we don't. All right, so let me look. I don't even think I found a cold biome. Oh, yeah, I did. I did find a cold biome, but there was no Weezworts up here. 
look at this. See if we can find another cold biome. Um, it's vacuum, vacuum. There's one right here, so I may need to go into there. How's the germs look in that area? Oh, not too bad. Not too bad. All right, we can we can do this. So go ahead and set this up. Yes, if it's not one thing, if it's not one thing, it's another. I tell you, I tell you. Cancel that. Put a that there. There we go. And what I could also start doing is uh, I would want to get rid of this door. So let's deconstruct. Let's deconstruct that door, and then in turn I can deconstruct all of this. All of that. Wait, I want to do it one at a little, little bit at a time because I don't want anybody to get stuck. And then all of these can be... Let's do them two at a time. Deconstruct all that, please. Thank you very much. Doing a little base remodeling today, boys and gals. Alright, they're deconstructing the loom, which is good. There we go. So now that we, they can de deconstruct that, I can do this. And then these need to be deconstructed. There we go. And then deconstruct this. I, I know it's a, it, you know, when you overlay things and, and stuff and stuff of that nature, when you try to, like, you replace a tile with a, a, another tile and you replace this with another. I, don't, I know it's, it loses your resources, but... And some of those resources are very minimalistic, but I want to try to save as much as we can because it is very, very useful to, to keep that kind of thing going. So let's deconstruct this, please. Thank you very much. So now that we've got that done, we can actually place... Uh, we can make these out of... Yeah, make them out of copper. We have a ton of copper. So do that. Uh, probably cancel that and make this a solid solid wall there and then I can deconstruct those two because those ladders would no longer be necessary because that would not be in ex or entrance or exit so there we go looks like they're doing pretty good get it going boys there you go all right so now now that 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 this is done I could put an electrolyzer here and then once they get uh, over there, I can start running all of the necessary plumbing. Uh, do insulated pipe. Where is our water? It's coming from there. Okay, I want uh, to get it started. Uh, to get it started, I'll need I need some of the water that we have over here. Doesn't look like we're producing enough though. All right, so. Looks like we're going to need some exosuits over there anyway. Oh, this is terrible. Terrible, terrible. Uh, let's see. How is this over here? This is fine. Let's just try to map this out. <clears throat> so, let's just go over like this, I guess. Taking all of this out. I cancel that. That should be a decent space and then what we can do is go into our power and where is it power transformer oh we're gonna have to find a way to get power over there oh boy uh what i could do is put the power transformer let's see where would be a good place to put that and run the wire hmm Well, the power transformer that I need to go there, I could put, say, here. Yeah, let's put that power transformer for the electrolyzer and everything to, to get that oxygen up and running. Let's put that over here. So, heavy watt wire, put it using uh, iron. Iron's good. And then I'll just connect. Um, you know what? Cancel. Whoops cancel this I found a nifty little trick if most people don't know if you have a your power transformer and you're just kind of like you don't want your wires to crisscross and use too many resources to to fix it manually what you could do is press O and flips so what I could do there is flip it around that way I have access to the internal power or the input and take the 
regular wire. I do it like this. That may work. I don't know if they'll be able to reach that. But... Actually, hold on. Let's see what I could do to, to alleviate this issue. What I could do is this. So that way I can run it through. Um, cancel that tile and then build up a ladder into this area. And just dig all this out. I don't know if they'll be able to hit this. But what I could do is just to simplify things. Uh, and then deconstruct this, cancel this, and then deconstruct those two. I think that might work. Yeah, I think that'll work. And then I can use this little space up here. I can close it off, do whatever I need to, so that way I don't lose any oxygen or anything like that. So I could probably even cancel cancel that build there so it stays. There's only one way in, one way out type thing. All right, so now that we've got that done, put another... Well, actually cancel this. I want to deconstruct those two. Deconstruct that. Eventually just take out this entire ladder altogether. Hopefully they'll fix this one instead. There we go. Now that that one's done, make another airflow tile out of copper. There we go. And then I can put another electrolyzer, say, here. You don't want them, like, on top of each other, but you don't want them too spaced apart either. Because, yeah. And see, with the way the oxygen goes, the hydrogen will go upwards... And the oxygen will flow gradually down to the bottom of the base. And once they get this fixed, then what I could do, say, is go like this. And let's deconstruct these two. There we go. So this is what? Uh, can't place there. So one, two, three. One, two, three. So deconstruct that one. That way it makes it even, basically. I'll probably do this. So, let's see. From the top of the electrolyzer, it's one, two, three to the top. So, one, two, three. There we go. And then it would be this, this, this. Um... Oh, that's not going to be even. How, how wide is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ah, uh, that's why it's an, uh, it's an even number. So even numbers, you really don't get odd results, which is basically what makes it even. I know that's kind of counterintuitive, but what I could do, I guess, is deconstruct or cancel those, do this instead. And in that case, it'd be, it'd be about right. Honestly, I think. Yeah, it'd be right. So come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's uh, prioritize these. So that way they can get over... Actually, no. Well, you can still prioritize that, but we need to dig this out. To get to where we're needing to go. So dig this. Up. Out of nine. There we go. Get those done, boys. Oh, I see what they're having issues with. Uh, dig, dig that as an, at a nine as well. And since we kept, oh my goodness, and since we kept our base at a low priority, uh, level nine is like, do it now, basically. So, I, I like that kind of attitude towards things. And even still, I guess, I guess I could cancel this. Don't, not, not have to waste any resources, since I do already have this built. Um, uh, so they have this door to get in here. I'll need a ladder to get up through there. And I think we can get that built. That looks good. That looks good. So now I want to go ahead and do this, 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 all this, do this, dig out all this. There we go. Uh, let's see. We have that built. The wire, This wire still needs to get built. But, because it's on its own transformer, I'm not really worried about how much power or any of the heavy wire going through there. Uh, speaking of, we could still do some more research. Ooh, what, what would be next? Clock sensor, weighted pressure plate, no, not really. 
what would be something that we can use right now? Uh, the water distiller. There's the water water sieve is what it's called. That I could actually use. Uh, we also need to get the uh, w the thermo sensor as well. But hopefully they'll get that done relatively quickly. If not, then what I could do is just say, hey, I want this done. Because even though even though I'm not, you know, using dirty dirty water, germy water, I oh boy no. no. Oh no 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 no! It's gonna flood my base. No, and of course it's nighttime. Oh my goodness, my base is flooded. My hatches are gonna die. No. Stay, stay, stay. Stay there, Hatches. I'll, I'll get you out. I'll get you out. Oh, man. Uh, put this back to a five. I need that water cut off. Oh, no. She's stuck in there now. Oh, my goodness. Disastrous, man. Disastrous. Uh, get... Okay, cancel this. Dig... Dig your way out of that. Please dig your way out of that. Uh, uh, my base is already flooded. I've probably lost all my hatches. You know what? Let's just, uh... Load. Let's load back. Well, we're at cycle 90. I know this is probably kind of cheaty, but that's what a game is saved for. See, let's load back to cycle 78. See if we can re redo what we're actually done. Ugh. See, is that is that still okay? That was before I did any of this. All right, so let's load up seventy nine. It's amazing how much you can get done in one cycle. Okay, so what I'll do is, hmm, that's sand, so it's going to fall when these get undone. I still don't want that water coming through, so what I can do here is cancel this ladder. Okay, we've already got that built, good, good, good. What I can do is cancel this, cancel basically all of that. Uh, go ahead and research the water distiller because we're going to need it. Um, Alright, they'll be able to reach most of this here. So cancel that. Well, they're going to dig it out anyway, so it really doesn't matter. Honestly. What I could do... Let's see. Go to... The tile here. Cancel this and then just go back... Just go back up here. Hopefully this uh the hold up. I don't know, so just in case I'll uh I can reinforce it. I can reinforce it. And the water will come over this way and fall down into our water anyway, so and it's not germy. Yeah, it's not germy at all. So that that might be a better better approach. So get this built, get this built. Take these these down. Get that built. There we go. So all we have to do now is literally just uh, place that there. Place another airflow tile there. Get this all dug out. And gotta remember. I gotta remember how I had that that set up though. So what I'd go, what I do from here? I went up one and did this, and then that. So it would be this, 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 and this. Yeah, there we go. That's that's about right. And then what I did here is put a ladder up. Whoops. Put a ladder up so they can get up to the top. Uh, I'm going to actually add on to that, making a gas pump up there. 
I'm going to need a gas filter, which I will run. I think I can run it closer to the ground. Yeah, it's probably better to run it closer to the ground so that way I can branch it off a lot easier without less, less, that, and a lot of resources being used. So what we could do is actually put a, uh, further down the base, I say use just a regular old gas pipe. Probably need to use insulated, honestly. So this will go into the feed. And I will cycle for anything but hydrogen. So regular gas would come out this way. And I'll put it close to the bottom. Say maybe right there. Bottom of the base. Possibly. No, 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 no. Don't do it. Don't do it there. Do it, say, here. Yeah. And then put a gas vent there. That looks good. And then what I could do... Cancel this. Ventilation. Uh, do this. Go up this way. Yeah. So that way I can come off this way. And just do whatever with it, I guess. Put, like, a hydrogen system over here. That might work. Hopefully. Question mark. Uh-oh. Who made a mess? Why'd you make a mess? Oh, well, come on, guys. Dig that. If you gotta, if you gotta go, dig it. Go, go, go. There you go. So go ahead and dig that out, or deconstruct that. Thank you very much. And then I'll put this at a nine, so that way they just close that off. Don't even go in there. And then I'll have to clean up this mess once we get in here. Uh, speaking of, let's mop. Because I know it's up here. Oh, wait. Where did that where did that mess go? Ah, it's down. <gasps> no! Get it now! Get it now! No, 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 no! Don't! Oh, no. It contaminated the water. Can we... Can we mop that? Please let us mop that. Please. Get that too. They're not going to be a reach that are, are they? No. Man. That sucks. That sucks really bad. Oh, well. What can you do? What can you do? Hatches, are you doing okay down here? Yeah, they're doing fine. They're doing fine. All right, how's our food? We're doing good. We got uh, 26,000 lice loaf. Doing good. We might upgrade our food a little bit later. Uh, oh, wow. I just noticed that the there's a bunch of nastiness right there as well. There we go. What I could do is let this dip down. And I thought, oh, wow, that's just super, super hot down there. But good thing I have the insulated tile. Otherwise, that heat would probably escape within the base. And that's not, that's not ideal. Okay. So... All right, guys, can we can we get this going? On, can we get this show on the road, please? I would really appreciate it. Actually, just have this all done. Cause yeah, we're running we're running really low on oxygen. Well, not really, really low. We're still in legal limits or breathable limits, but. Speaking of, did they get the this water distill for uh, water sieves? Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, so I think naturally what I want is like to have the water purifier close to. I mean, I guess it really doesn't matter. Have it like really close, like over here, put like three of them, I guess. And then what we could do is uh, this is probably going to take a two-part episode. This is going to be bad. Um. All right, the water comes off there. That's dirty water. So we actually want to make use of said dirty water. Uh, cancel that. Have the dirty water go up and in. In. Oh, no. No, 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 no. How am I going to? I'm going to need to top it. Go out through the top. I'm glad I'm thinking about this on the go. So what I'll do here is plumbing. 
up like this. There we go. And then what I could do then is take the nastiness. Yeah, go through this. Go, say, up through here. Uh, where am I going to have my holding tank? Hmm. Because I don't want the water sieves running all the time. Because naturally we're not going to be producing more than we need. So it would have to be a mi I guess it would have to be a mixture of clean water versus not clean water. All right, but that's that's a good foundation to get started. Uh, we want to make sure that all these are connected. And who knows? I may not want to like put it anywhere. I may just keep it in pipes, so I could literally just do something like like this. And for future future dates, you know, I could have it just pump straight into. You know, have it like an alternative, kind of. If that be the case, what I could do with water pipe, like I drink it from here, I could put like a water bridge or a liquid bridge, say here, so liquid can only go through that way. And then on this side, I can do the same. So that way, liquid the liquids don't cross. I think that's a smart idea. So then now that, now that I have that set up, I could be like, okay, this... And then that, and then connect them. So that way, liquid can come up and through, and then this liquid can come up and through. So, yeah. Is there a water shut off? Yeah, liquid shut off. Automatically turns liquid flow off and on using automation technology. Or I can use a liquid valve, but they still... Yeah, let's start using some of the automated stuff since we, since we have it. So what we can do here, did I run that pipe up yet? No, 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 I haven't. So what I can do here is put one of these here. Let's cancel. Hmm, where would be a good place to put that? Does it require energy? That's the question. I haven't run with any of this before. Uh, it takes 10 watts of power. See, that's, that's the thing I was worried about. So if I don't do those don't use that i can do the alternate alternative of a liquid valve which takes no power whatsoever and have it set up like this and have another one i want to try to keep it even i don't think i'm going to be able to keep it even now it, it'll be fine though all right, <clears throat> now that we've got that set up, then I could just, uh, still not where I want it, because that liquid bridge goes there. Oh, planning out the base is so hard. All right. I want it to go in. Like that, and then pipe it over. Oh, wait, no, 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 we can get this, we can get this. Liquid valve, put that there, and then run that into there, and then run it out there. It's kind of messy, but it works. It works. So then I could have this go in there and then just draw, say, from here. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want that hot liquid uh, causing issues. So, oops. Uh, plumbing, insulated pipe. Yes. Cancel. Plumbing. Uh, actually, liquid bridge. Yeah, there we go. Liquid bridge that with some insulated piping straight into it yeah 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 uh probably want to cancel that piping as well uh make it because this is going to be the hot side this is like hot and cold water basically because the the water coming out of the uh water filtration is going to be super 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 cold or not really super cold but not as hot as the hot water that we're pumping through the base now so, I guess in that case, I would need all of these. Technically, yeah. I need these to be insulated pipe as well. So, here we go. Run that in. Run that in. And then, there we go. That should work. Yeah. Because the water... This 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 line is going to be simple, simply cold. So, hopefully they'll get all this done. Uh, get all that done, taken care of. 
Uh, get ventilation, get ourselves a gas pump put up there. That looks good, like looks good. Power it all up. And wire everything up. Hopefully I'm not overloading the circuits here. I'm hoping I'm not overloading the circuits. Uh, and then I also want a... What is this? Uh, ventil is it under ventilation now? Nope, it's still under power. No. Where is it? Automation? Yeah, there we go. Atmos switch. Turn this. Put the Atmos switch there. And it's cool how a lot of these things are already... Because I really haven't started a new world... Uh, this is automatically, everything is, is the same, everything's working fine, and it's already integrated with the, the signal stuff, which is awesome. Speaking of, they, they built the switch, so I really want to, no, 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 cancel, 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 ooh, that was close. Uh, I want to deconstruct this airlock, and then in turn, I want to add a mechanized airlock made out of gold amalgam, because I don't want it to leak. I don't want it to, well, not necessarily leak, but I don't want it to, uh, overheat because things that you build, depending on the metal you build it out of depends on if it overheat and, and things of that nature. So I want it to naturally, you know, rise in temperature or cool depending on what's going on, especially gold amalgam has a uh, overheat temperature of plus 90 degrees Fahrenheit, Fahrenheit, which is pretty good. Uh, I mean, iron, iron, not so much. And copper, copper not so much. Copper just will melt if given a hot temperature, too too much hot temperature. But hopefully they'll get this done. I'll put this on a level 9, and it's nighttime. But then what I'll do is I'll put this door, because if any... Oh, well, it's supposed to, supposed to have automation? Yeah. See, the door has automation. So what I can do is have this switch. What I can do is once I get this door built, the mechanized door built, I can lock this door get rid of this door completely and then i can just control the flow of water remotely with automation and we're using using it to, to its greatest effect i think that's one way i thought of doing pretty good with automation um and it just hit me it's like hey instead of keeping my duplicates getting scalding and giving uh giving them like super super stress um we can make a mechanized door with a switch and go forth I mean, yes, it's less effective. I mean, you, we are using more resources, but it keeps my duplicates happy. So if I can, if I can spare, yeah. See, I'm getting heat stroke, and that's mm -mm. all right. So now that we've got that, we can set up an automated wire. Boom. We need some more. Uh, we need some more resource. We need more metal, actually. Uh, do we have... Yeah, we need some more copper. Can somebody make it, please? Well, get out of there! Let me lock this door. Thank you for locking that door. Okay. Can, can we get this done, please? I need... I need more... I need more copper. Oh, they already finished the research already? Wow. They're pretty good. Uh, I could probably use with a thermo switch next. But I do... Where are they building? Where are they at? Where are they building? Oh, they're still up there. That's that's fine. That's fine. Where are you got? Come on, guys. Get this done. I mean, technically, I guess I can move that. You know what? Yeah, 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 yeah. Cancel this. Cancel all this. Uh, not necessarily that. And then deconstruct. Cancel that, and then deconstruct this. And move that switch just a touch closer. Yeah, move that switch kind of like right here, please. And then what I could do then, I don't, I don't have enough resources now. Ugh. Come on, somebody make me some copper, please. It's not pumping. What? Oh. Okay, I need to get that done. That's why we're halted on that. Come on, guys, get this done.
That's why we've halted. Oh, such such bad stuff. Oh, I'm such bad. Oh. If I would have seen that earlier, I would have had them do that faster. All right, let them get that done first. Hopefully that'll push push its water. You know one thing I, I think they should make? And I think it was a good be a good idea. As you can see with this wire or with these with these pump things, uh the orange if it's orange, uh it basically means it's insulated. If <clears throat> if we come over here, the gas bridges or the liquid bridges, they're regular. So they really don't keep in the heat or you know, they basically expel it. So the next thing I would like to see added would be probably a uh, insulated gas bridge or insulated liquid bridge. That would be awesome. That would be completely awesome. All right, so come on guys. Can we build this please? I'd much appreciate it. I know you got other things to do, but you you got plenty of food. Your stress is low. There's nothing really much to go by. You're making more copper for me, which is awesome. Yes, yes. Almost. Almost. And then what I could do is just say, hey, turn this switch on. Let the water come in. Flip it back off. Let the water flow back out. Or just hold it off so that the water doesn't flow. Because I don't want to fill up my base down here with water. It just, oh, I don't want to flood it. Especially since this, these Wheeze warts can't really endure too much water. So is that is that good? So yeah, uh, turn it off. And I want to keep people from going through there. Ah, it works! It works! We are victorious! Nice, nice. So yes, now what I can do is be a lot smarter with this. Um, and block this off with the heat. And then I can literally just get rid of... Uh, get rid of this door. Honestly. I don't really need it. So let's get... Let's keep this... Get this done. I know there's probably a menial tax that I want done right now. But I want to... I don't want to forget about it. And then come back later and it's like... Well, why is this not working? Can you somewhere to tell me why this is not working? So doing good. Sandstone. Sandstone's just as good at any material as far as the insulated tiles go. And we have tons of it. We're running really low on gold amalgam though. That's the bad thing. We have 14.6 tons of iron. Or 14.7 tons of iron and 14.6 tons of coal. So that is just insane. But we do need to get them. That's unreachable. How about when we open this? Let, see if they flip the switch. Does it become reachable? Yes. So let me go ahead and get them to get that done. Get in there and get that done. Please. Please. Yes, I know you're going to be scalding. But just, just bear with me. Just bear with me. Just do it. Please. The water doesn't seem that badly overflowing, but it, I know it will become a problem soon if I don't get it fixed. There we go. So now, turn this off. Perfect. Now that door's locked. Nobody can go in. And just this, this place is going to get really hot really fast. Probably would do me some good to put some wheeze warts here. Or even double insulate it? I don't know, though. We'll have to see. We'll have to see. Alright, so have you guys got this done yet? No, not yet. Not yet. How's our oxygen doing? Uh, not too bad. I mean, we only have eight duplicates. So, only have eight duplicates. But, I was thinking, I've been watching a lot of other YouTubers and other streamers and stuff doing the... Uh, every duplicate challenge. Uh, I would be interested in doing that if everybody else would be interested in watching it. Uh, let me know. I will. I will continue on my episode or escapade of, you know, keeping keeping this alive, doing our base, you know, base 101, I, as I call it, our our, our paradise base. 
Uh, but anything else, like it's challenges, I'll keep on a separate save file. So if that's something you all would like me to do, then please do let me know in the comments below. But, I mean, I, I wanted to get the water purifier thing up today, but I knew it wasn't going to get done that quickly. It's, uh, it's just horrible. Um... But hopefully that will run. I mean, I usually just use the, the hot water anyway. So, But anyway, <clears throat> thank everybody for watching. If you did enjoy the video, please do remember to give it a big thumbs up. It really lets me know that you're liking the series thus far. And you let me know that uh, I should continue doing what I'm doing. Uh, other than that, if you have any tips, tri uh, tips, tricks, and other you know, fancy things you would like me to do as far as this game is concerned. You know, something that I may not know or may know and just make it, you might have a better improve, uh, improvisation way of doing things. Then, then please, by all means, use that comment section down below and let me know what is going on. Other than that, I think we're, we're well on our way to getting some decent oxygen and staying away from algae because we're our algae is like almost half now. But of course, we have algae all around. But anyway, anyway, thank everybody so much for watching. And until next time. See you later.